All right, so we just finished our before flight meal. We got a couple hours until the flight. Uh, and uh, we're trying to figure out where the gate is right now. So Jeremy, what just happened? What? What happened? Well, we walked to Florida. Mm -hmm. It took us a few days, but we made it. Ignore so, the seats, just ignore the seats. These aren't plane seats or anything. Bench. So, yeah. We're gonna go to the bus now in a couple minutes. We gotta get our. Uh, it's it's you gotta get your it's off. about midnight. Late flight. There's Joe and all them. All right, so we're at the hotel. It's about 2 a.m. We're trying to get situated. Um, gotta wake up at 5:30 tomorrow. Be at the bus by 7. It's not gonna be fun. Not feeling it. <laughs> All right, Jamie, so what time is it? Uh, seven. Nope, five. It's about 6.26. We woke up at about 5, 5.30ish, after going to bed at 2.30. Needless to say, it's it's gonna be a rough morning. All right, so we just got back from the, uh, the Disney leadership class. It's pretty cool. Our tour guide, Jill, she uh, passed a lot. I think that we could all learn from this experience. I'm not by myself. So, yeah. We're vlogging, there's Jeremy vlogging, there's Elise vlogging, there's Joe vlogging, I'm sure there's other people vlogging. There's the castle, we're here at the Magic Kingdom. Jeremy, how do you feel about this? I, I feel darn good. Jeremy feels darn good. You heard it here first. Joe twisted his ankle, <laughs> so uh, it's, gonna be a, it's gonna be a rough one. This ride. I hate this ride. <laughs> Why do you hate this ride, Joe? Waitress, right there, and uh, it's a good meal. Good meal. There's Joe vlogging. I just had 50 hours. And uh, there's Jeremy vlogging. I'm not vlogging. Leah is not vlogging right now. Not yet. Not yet. But uh, we're exhausted for stuff. We're about to hit the park again. So wish us luck. <laughs> All right, so we're uh, we're lost. We're, we're lost. And uh, we separated to go to Splash Mountain. Was and that? We never, and we didn't even go. Did, didn't go. We went to a store. That's pretty Circle cool. Circle Top Souvenirs, whatever it was called. Big Top. Sorry. I got and, it. And uh, we're still happy we're Disney. We got it. Bird. Oh. 
Oh, we're going the wrong way. All right. Jeremy, would you like to park the peanut? It's not that way. I don't think so. I think it's that way. But I don't want to be wrong. Oh, um, where is Yeah, where is Haunted Mansion? Thank you. Take down the path on the right. Shout out to that guy. All right. Do we know where we're going this way? Yeah. All right. So my mirrored image. All right. We were all the way down by the carnival, and the guy's like, "Well, you can. You're on the total opposite side of the ride, so you can either take a train and go that way." And we're like, "Yeah, no." So then we're like, "Okay, I guess we'll call Jeremy." And then we got lost, and then. And we're at the cool kids table. The cool kids table. No, look like under. Happy birthday, Noah and Jeremy. You guys enjoy your dinner, okay? Thank you. And we're going to have some fun. We're going to do a coconut breeze. And just letting you know, all beautiful and handsome 16 year olds are invited. All you got to do is just say loose and have fun with us. Would you guys like to sing a fun Hawaiian song before I leave? Yeah. All right, so let me see everybody now. Anybody in the restaurant can join in. Let me see you guys shake the shaka sign like that. Put out your thumb and your pinky. And remember, that's another way that Hawaiians greet each other. It means take loose and have fun. So are you guys ready? All you need to do, we're going to celebrate Jeremy and Noah's birthday. So just repeat after me. Are you guys ready? Jeremy, get the ukulele. All right, let me hear you. Just hang loose. Just have fun. Just have fun. Sip beyond a soda. Sip beyond a soda. Lying in the sun. Lying in the sun. Don't try to fight it. Don't try to fight it. It's just no use. Just no use. When we're in Hawaii. When you're in Hawaii. You should just hang loose. You should just, just hang loose. I might get my news. When you're at Ohana. When you're at Ohana. <laughs> Just and when you celebrate your birthday, and you celebrate your birthday, just just hey, hey. All right, so thoughts on tonight's dinner? Go for it. <laughs> it, was, it was good. I threw in the towel. Uh, I'm tired. It was okay. It was really good. Very good. Yeah. Accept me, acceptable, Joe? Get on me. On me. The I'm shrimp dumplings were good. It looked like they they cooked it with um, peanut oil in the wait in the um, dough. The egg noodles were good. They were a little firm, but they could have been cooked for a little bit longer. Um, I didn't try the vegetables because. To be honest, who's gonna eat vegetables here? Like, eat the Disney. steak. It's Disney. The steak was good. It was medium to medium rare. We're gonna take your plate and um, it, it was a little to tough. Calm down the chicken minute. was really tender. Um, it had really good seasoning. Without being a food critic. Because it, it had a really a really nice sweet seasoning, and they kept the elements used in the peanut oil for the uh, dumplings, so the flavors really. really 
as it were. Um, at the end of the day, the meal really, it really works, honestly. Um, it's good, but if we pay more than 50 bucks for it, it really works, honestly. All right, so I I thought there, there's Casita doing something. Yeah, what? That that's not a human. Whatever you just showed that me. Was this, all right, so ended it there. So we just got dessert. Um, I believe it was a pineapple banana. There's coconut in there. Coconut. Coconut banana or coconut pineapple kind of cakey thing with ice cream on top and a caramel sauce dribbled on top. This is what's which, left. Which really. There's also one over there. Um, it had the consistency of like a thick pan, um, a dense Jeremy pancake. Jeremy Augusta's good eats. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting that. It had it had the consistency of like a dense pancake and almost the flavor of just a plain cream. So the the pineapple really added some some flavor into it and it really made it like, addicting. <laughs> that made a food critic. Mommy, mommy, mommy. The ice cream on the other hand, it's just vanilla ice cream. So. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy's final review of Ohana, the buffet oh, family style. You say buffet? <laughs> Alright, so last day, we're at Hollywood Studios. There it is. Um, it's gonna be sad to go, but I'm not that sad since I am exhausted. He wants to holding. sleep. I have a lens Here's in. Noah. There's Noah. Uh, uh, everybody else is vlogging. See, there's Jeremy, Bill, and uh, hopefully it's a good last day. All right, so today's the last day. Pretty sad. We're in the hotel lobby right now, trying to get our stuff together. Jeremy, how you feeling? Tired. No one. Jillian, how you feeling? Excited. Excited? I don't want to go home. Well, I don't want to go home either, but I am exhausted, and I feel like I need a need a rest. So, it is what it is. All right, so we're leaving today. We're gonna go, we're gonna, here's everyone. I don't want videos, can I? We're all pretty sad except for Liv. She, 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 she seemed pretty happy right there. No, no, I'm uh, not <laughs> But uh, yeah, it got, yesterday got short because of rain. Today was great at Disney Springs, but yeah, sad to be done. All right, so we're at Outback, <laughs> and no, don't put on me. It's, okay, it's Jamie then. We four of us ordered steaks. <laughs> four, <laughs> four, <laughs> four of us ordered steaks, and we're confused because we have plastic utensils. I don't know if it's gonna cut. <laughs> Literally. Literally. <laughs> yeah. I don't have that, the four on steaks. Oh well. Basically, a weightlifting. I'm just gonna eat it like. So you, just with your hands. Just go like straight up. Um, if if metal utensils come, I mean, I guess I'll, 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 I'll update it. It is an airport to be double set. But in Detroit, they had it. They did have it in Detroit. That's never been said before. Detroit's a little ghetto. De Detroit's awesome. It is. But, <laughs> so what's your story? I dropped lettuce on my lap, and I didn't want I didn't want my lap to get stained on my bed. So I went to the bathroom to wash it off. There's a wet stain. Slightly above my crotch area. <laughs> I didn't pee. It's, I wash it. I went to walk into the bathroom and I look at I look at the bathroom and I say that's the bathroom. So I walk into the bathroom. I walk, I don't see toilets or anything. But instead some lady starts yelling at me in Spanish. I don't speak Spanish. So I turn around to the lady, she points up, and it turns out the sign that I was looking at was for the woman's bathroom. Oh my god. So after walking into the woman's bathroom, she points at me, looks at all of her five janitor friends hanging out with her, and they all start yelling things in Spanish and laughing at me and pointing. They're going, ha 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 ha. And saying things in Spanish, no, so I have a mob of Spaniards yell, laughing at me. Spaniards. I walk in. I walk into the into the men's restroom. Can you tell me who says that? Watch off a little bit. Yeah. Head out. They're still laughing as I walk out of the bathroom. They're going, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> so that's my bathroom story. That's your bathroom story. There I am. Disney trip 2016. I'm going to All right. So recap. Um, I personally really enjoyed the trip. I learned a lot from it and could tell that Disney puts a lot into what they do. Um, from the leadership to what they have to do and like all the stuff that they have to make sure their employees do. 
and like the trust that goes on between them, it's amazing. And we can definitely incorporate that in the, into the yearbook class next year, as well as the teamwork aspect of it. Like the last class was amazing. I've never seen any group of people, especially our class, come together and work like so quickly together, not knowing what we were doing, getting into it. It was just amazing. And I hope I can do this again, go on the trip and learn even more. So the physics and zoology classes were cool, but the teamwork and leadership are where I think that I benefited the most from. So had fun. Can't wait for next year.